Hey everyone, uh, I haven't recorded a video video in a while because I got kind of busy, but uh, this is the actually this is the second in the series of the web uh, category of challenges for points or overflow CTF. Um, so this is Vigil of the Ceaseless Eyes. Um, we are given. Uh, so I had a user, I had a guy um, comment, guy or girl, I don't know, um, or you know whatever. Uh, and um, they were wondering about the other challenges and uh, and so yeah this is the second one in the series I haven't solved the third one actually so if anybody is watching this and they have solved the the quantity is not abundance and let me know because I'm having trouble with that um, and so yeah yeah this, this one is this one's kind of um, you got to think outside the box a little bit it's not like a you know straightforward you know, it's not really a big analysis or big penetration stuff, so it's kind of cool. So we're given many kins, you know, zero chance vulnerabilities. We're given a directory, secret flag dot PDF for that file. So if we go here, we're given a website. Uh, you know, it's just like a blog site, sort of. You know, I I uh, I wasn't really grown up in the era of MySpace, but um, it I guess this is kind of what it reminds me of and uh, you know you can post stuff um, you know one thing that you that you could try here is you you can actually um, you could it'll actually accept you know uh, HTML um, yeah as you can see right there and I believe it'll also do JavaScript, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, no, it won't. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah. But, I mean, that doesn't have anything to do with the solution. I'm just letting you know. Um, I don't know if that was intentional or not. Probably was. But, uh, yeah, so let's go to secretflag.pdf. Um, if we go to that directory, we actually have, we're viewing a PDF here. Um, this is with Google Chrome, you know, so if it's failed to load the PDF document. Uh, so we're on the right track, but um, there's no way to view the contents of this. So one thing we can do is we can actually use a wget. Um, so let's copy this directory. I'm going to open up my, uh, my Linux here, and we're going to go, we're going to do a terminal here, not a, not Firefox. We're going to do wget and we're going to paste in this and we're going to specify an output of flag.pdf. Press enter. Okay, and now if we view, we have our flag.pdf. So let's do a cat of flag.pdf and we have the flag right there. It's as simple as that. Um, you know, this is one of the easier ones. Uh, honestly, I think that this one should have been for 100 points. Um, but yeah, so uh, had to think outside the box a little bit there. And uh, hopefully this helps you.